Hello, uh, I just want, wanted to, com to comment uh, about uh, the last video I have posted and uh, I usually uh, write uh, stuff related to the video I uh, post in the description box when I show uh, stuff from the skies but uh, I uh, felt like I was uh, want, uh, want, wanting, wanting to tell something uh, for the ch Christian people and uh, for uh, all humans uh, this is about uh, the the meaning of jesus christ in my life and in the life of the uh, so-called christian people you know it is uh, it is important to uh, to know the difference between uh, uh, the, uh, the christian uh, christian uh, priests who talk about jesus christ and uh, they uh, try to uh, to convince people uh, when uh, they ask uh, why uh, God uh, should uh, uh, should sacrifice his own son that humans will um, uh, be cleansed from their sins and uh, through blood sacrifice and this is uh, just like uh, it's like uh, trying to to fool people by saying this stuff and this is a great blasphemy against God to say this stuff Jesus Christ was not sacrificed Jesus Christ was killed and tortured by us the humans we have killed Jesus Christ the son of the most high God King Anu we killed him on the cross and we tortured him and the reason I say we, because all people living in this age are reincarnated through all ages to witness the end times and to uh, have a stand about what is happening and what to happen and what will be happening now in the end times. So uh, God, the real God, does not need a sacrifice. Uh, this is Jesus Christ is not a goat that we sacrifice to God. Jesus Christ was killed because he helped Eve. He convinced her to eat from the tree of knowledge. So Jesus Christ is the light. I told before that you, you cannot have knowledge if you don't have light. So if you live in the if you are born in a cave and uh, all your life you have been darkness and your family is in a cave and you want to go out and learn about the world outside the cave. You need to have light to see what is around you. So Jesus Christ is not a sacrifice because humans did not sin against God humans did not sin the first human he was called Adapa and Adapa he went up to heaven because he cursed his wife why did he curse his wife because he thought he was more important than her he wanted her to be his slave this it this is the devil who told him, I will make you a master. I will give you slaves. If you allow me to be your master, if you allow me to enslave you, I will give you slaves. So this is how humans uh, work. They allow anybody to be their, their God if this anybody give them what they want and what do they want like this uh, light worker Gina I just watched her video she told uh, that uh, men seek power but they need actually love but I go far farther and I say, unfortunately, 
humans want slaves. They want to enslave all others. And when they get these feelings, they enslave their wives, their family, their fellow humans. They feel the power. And this is the greed. And this is the ego. And because of the ego, we cannot do magic. The real magic, you can shake the mountain if you take away your ego. This is what Jesus Christ, our Lord, ha has to have told us. Remove your ego and you can do magic. Just ask God for anything and it will be fulfilled. But you must remove your ego first. So this is the message I want to share with the world today. And the world is falling and the matrix is falling. We see stuff in the skies. But nobody cares. Everybody wants to, un to enslave more and more and get more power. And the world, world is falling. And with, soon it will be destroyed. And the Holy Bible will show, prove itself real when the Son of Man returns and all nations and tribes will mourn, will be sad because of their behavior. This is my message today. Please enjoy and have a blessed day. Time is nigh. Prepare.